Hey guys, I'm HP, this is Dr. Pink, and today's topic is the AT Rodex. <laughs> uh, in English, nasty rock guitar licks. <laughs> but before we get started, make sure you subscribe to my channel, hit the notification button, and also join the HP Crazy Guitar Academy. The link is in the description box below. There you can download the tabs and the backing track for this tutorial. In. So, how does this stuff sound like? Has to be crazy. Yeah, stuff like that. It's gonna be crazy. <laughs> Good. Before we get started, what well, the first sound settings. High gain sound with compression. Beginning compression, then the amp. Then the cabinet, if you have uh, something like I have here in the studio. Then a stereo delay. Set on the quarter note of the song with uh, 50% feedback, which creates four, five, seven repeats. That gives you a really fat and wide sound. Better would be a ping pong delay if you have one. Same, um, put the feedback level on 50% to get the seven repeats. Yeah, and then let's check out the legs or the ideas how the stuff is played. I mean, it's really cool. This is, this is also an intention, not only the legs, it's how you really jump in leg. <laughs> You know what I mean. <laughs> okay guys, I switched off the delay now to show you the licks because um, otherwise it confuses you a little bit when you always have a delay. But at the end you have to switch it on again. Well, you don't have to, but it really gives you a really wide sound. Now, on the track which I've chosen is in E, so it's going to be the licks going to be shown in E, but not necessarily have to be in this key, but uh, in E it really works best this case. So, I'm using two positions. I'm using A minor pointatonics here in this position. And E minor, uh, e minor pentatonic and also E minor pentatonics here. Also additional notes and also I also go to the lower position here. I start in the lower position of the E minor pentatonics here five seven five seven five seven. Then I move up up till here and connect positions. Yeah. And also go to the high note here. Also here, well, we go to this later. So, how do we start? The main position to start is always position number four. This is this one. Um, and the, let's say, 80% of the entry legs is this one. You just go into the bending and create kind of a drama. And then it up with a really wide vibrator. Probably a pinch harmonic as well. Let's see how that works.
is not really not much needed, but the pinch harmonic is pretty essential, you know, and also the, the drama on the bending. You could also add pinch harmonics here. Yeah, that's really, well, this is a standard opening, I must say, but uh, just because it's standard doesn't mean it's bad, you know. So. Can repeat again. Yeah. Now we want to push it to the next level of um, intensity <laughs> of nastiness. I really love this one here. Why? Because of this. This is a tritone interval. Tritone is a is a flat fifth interval. And together with this one we have here nine, eight, seven. This thing is really sounds nasty and if you use it as a light ring thing. You know? Just by doing this chord it really gives this oomph, you know, this oomph. And this, the, the sixth here, the, this is the interval, is the sixth here. You can also use this when you jump in the higher position. This is the same note, you know, make half them. You can do the same. Here we have the tritone again, you know. You, you, you get the same effect by doing it with the banding and also with the chord. So let's see how that works. It's really cool. Now we do the band. Now you, you can end up the thing which going in the high position and do the same lick as here. Just an octave high, which will be here in the 17th fret. Or if this is too shortcutted for you, you can add a run. This one here. It's really cool. So you make a run here, you connect the positions. Five, seven, five, seven, five, seven, eight, nine, five, uh, seven, nine, eight, ten, eleven, twelve, ten. And then you jump in the bed. It's also cool. Run again. What you also can do is go in the resolve here on the root note here in the 70 fret and just repeat the note and give more vibrator to it the more you play it. I mean you can make it even more intense. Let me see if I can add some guava here with this camera thing here. Well, probably not. <laughs> also works. Yeah. I was lying here in the chair to still stay in the camera. 
Yeah, the Wawa is just an ad. You can do the whole thing with Wawa and it gets even more intense. But some of you might don't have a Wawa. So, now we need to speed up the thing. Probably if we do a repeating pattern here. Here. Bending here in the 14th. Release, pull off, hammer on, pull off. See, that's how it works. It's really cool. And you need to end it with a high bending. See? It's always important that you end up things with the drama, you know? Either drama could be... Or... And then go up in the high bending. That's really cool. Let's put together now uh, what you already worked out. And in between, I mean, these were just some ideas. In between, just try to stay intense and nasty. <laughs> really work on your pinch harmonics. The better you can do pinch harmonics and control them, the better it is because you could really do extreme bendings, extreme, extreme pinch harmonics. This really gives a really cool vibe. After the, the lick, before we need to put something additional on top. Well, this one, um, till now it was easy. Probably this one is too hard for everybody. Or for some of you, sorry. Um, but it's really, from all sweeping licks, I know it's the easiest one. And what you do is, you play sex dolls. And you, what do you do? You play. Here you play triads. Here a G major triad. One, two, three. You see? And you when you do the sweeping, you move up in one row. When you here, pull off. And now up soak. See? As I said, from all sweep pick uh, sweep legs, this is the way the easiest, I think. And now you just move up in triad. So then you go from G major to A major. You go to B minor. This will be here. You have here 11, 12, 10, 14. Then we have a diminished one. 10, 14, 10, 15. You could also go up here to the D major. And also up here to the E minor. And then you need to end it somehow. And then some at some point you need to get out of this lick here. This is it since it's six, so so one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, that's pretty fast. That's the speed, and you just 
brush through the thing and uh, don't be afraid if you don't really miss all you don't hit all strings uh, somehow it <laughs> you never do <laughs> and it works better when you go on the neck pickup i must say but uh, on those one it's not such a big thing and that could be a highlight then let's do that one here See? Yeah. Really works cool, but it's probably too hard for some of you, but just to give a highlight. So I'm gonna put everything together now again, and then you see how this whole thing works out. It's really cool. So always go to repeat the phrase, now we do the next. Yeah, guys, that was a summary of a few ideas how you can build up a really nasty uh, rock guitar solo or rock guitar licks. And the main thing is always keep the intensity high and pushing harder and harder and harder and getting to the top and always resolve a thing with something, you know. Hold on. That's the main element in all this, you know. These are just different types of ingredients which you can use of course but not necessarily you don't have to just play them in a row that's not really the idea you can just get wild and use those as their ideas to build things up always start slow and build up and when you're on the peak then go back down and that's basically the idea <coughs> how the whole thing is thought about and how this will work yeah, you can spice up the whole thing with Wawa. Before I wasn't really able to do so because <laughs> camera position was bad. I'm gonna play the same thing again now with Wawa for you at the end that you get an idea. I also can work with Wawa. Good, if you wanna download the tabs and the backing track, they're available in the HP Crazy Guitar Academy. Join there, make the premium membership upgrade. And there you get that. All this works, of course, for any other track in E, as in rock. Yeah, of course. Yo, so I'm going to play now with the Wawa. Already saying goodbye to you guys. And me and Dr. Pink are playing now. <laughs> <laughs> 